Hello everyone, this is T-Bird Bricks for another video. I'm excited to kick off my latest review. This is set number 76424, the Flying Ford Anglia out of the Harry Potter set. So this is from Chamber of Secrets and the car looks really good. I'm definitely interested in digging into what it's all about. From the surface, it looks like it's a two-seater. The doors open and I believe the trunk opens as well. Yeah. So here we have the set and we've had this car before, you know, a couple of different times in different like, you know, Hogwarts Express, uh, Escape from Privet Drive. However, this is the first time we've seen the Flying Ford Anglia all by itself. And they do not disappoint with the design of this set. I love the striping on the car, the slopes, the authentic build very nicely done lego really well done really well designed you know the way it works you take the top off here you'll love the tiling there you can get right inside and yes it is a two-seater really nice lego i love how they're getting more and more two-seater cars very great and you have the little uh kind of dashboard right there love the use of the i'm, I'm gonna try and pull it out here whoops <laughs> broke it off by mistake, but you have basically a tile piece to form as the steering wheel. I think that's really well intentionally designed, really smart on Lego's part. Yeah, this is a 100% brick built, nice plating and everything. Open the doors, boom, boom, really nicely done. Let's get to that moment of truth. Let's see that trunk. Oh yeah, that is a really good trunk. I, I can't believe I'm flipping out over a trunk, but Guys, it's like the first minifig scale car with an openable trunk. That's just so cool. I, I love it. Really nice. I might be able to do this all day. I don't know. <laughs> just really fun. I, I love it. That's just me, though. I, I just love authentic, accurate builds. That's what I'm all about, especially at the, the minifig scale level. Yeah, maybe not too minifig scale. This is a little big compared to these two, but still, you get the idea. Let's go ahead and get to the minifigures real quick. So here are two heroes. You have Harry on the right, Ron on the left, and they look pretty good. I, I definitely dig them. Um, they have reversible heads, which I'll show off in just a sec. So here are their scared faces, and yeah, they, they look pretty good. They, they know they're about to get hit by either the train or the Whomping Willow, as seen in the Chamber of Secrets. And of course, we can't forget their pets. You have Hedwig right here and uh, Peter Pettigrew. Oh, oh, sorry, Scabbers on the, the left there. Yeah, they look pretty good. Now, what's interesting about these two figures is I saw on Brick Set and Brick Link that these are two, they call them uh, new minifigures, which I don't agree with. We've definitely seen the legs before, the scared heads before, the hair, but apparently the torsos are new. So this is a brand new torso for Ron, brand new torso for Harry. And you can kind of see the front and back as well. So here's the front. There's the back, really nicely printed on both sides. Let's see Harry too real quick. Here's the front, love the collar, love the shirt. And here's the back as well. Really nice printing on the back, really well done. So apparently those are brand new torsos for these two minifigures, which I definitely think is fantastic. Really great addition to kind of add excitement to a set. So overall a great set. I would say an immediate flaw I see is when you put the minifigures in the car. So in order to get the doors to be able to close, you have to really fold their arms up. And also they, they are just barely fitting in there. There's really not much room to work with at all. And they basically stand up and that's because they have the, the really tiny legs. I, I get it, but still that's just kind of unfortunate for what we have here. So kind of a major flaw, but you can still make it work. You still have displayability. You still have you know, modeling it in a, a Lego city or something like that, you still have a lot to work with. So overall, you know, flawed car in the interior, the, the you know, the passenger's seat or the driver's seat, but still a really nice set, really well done, really overall well designed. Again, love that trunk. And you have many opportunities for this set. As a Harry Potter fan, definitely get this set. You get two new, new minifigures on the side as a result. And you can put this in the, your Lego city immediately. You can have a scene with like the trunk open to get out a spare tire. You can have it flying over their, your city, whatever you want to do. There's a lot of opportunities for this set. Really well done, really well designed. I definitely dig this set. Let me know what you think in the comments section. Be sure to like, share, and subscribe. And of course, have a wonderful day.